Oh man, how I started in music. Well, I started in music, I was, um, you know, it was kind of a chance thing, man, because I was a, I was a student out at, uh, out at um, UMBC for the summer program. Um, and um, they happened to be holding classes in the Fine Arts Building. And at that time, um, I happened to wander into the main recital hall with a big Steinway concert grand piano, you know. And I remember wandering into it, sitting down at this piano, and the very first thing I hit on the keyboard, I remember that it was like one of the most exciting moments. Oh man, well I've been blessed, man, to be able to work with um, quite a few people, man. I mean, I've um, worked with David Murray, of course, a great, great saxophonist, one of the real innovators in the music. I've worked with uh, Cassandra Wilson. Uh, I've worked with uh, Hamid Blewett, uh, Oliver Lake. Um, just a, uh, Craig Harris, just an array of people, um, Hamid Drake, just an array of people from that jazz and uh, um, avant-garde world. So I've been really blessed and that's taken me all over the planet, man. I mean, everywhere in Europe, um, Latin America, uh, Asia, North Africa, yeah. been quite, been around. Now it doesn't make a difference to me. Um, it, um, when I'm playing with people, I'm I'm looking for where their soul and their energy is coming from. And um, since we're human beings, you know, it's not hard to, to to get something going on the stage. You know, at least I've never found it to be terribly hard. First, what, what first sparked the, the idea for the lyric was um, listening to a blind gentleman describe what he heard. And then um, the words, um, did you see it? Did you hear it? You know, those, those began to come. And then um, the form began to kind of reveal itself at the same time the lyrics revealed itself. But I was watching it like everybody else and, and, um, and, and, and had I think the same feeling that, um, that a lot of us um, in the black community have. So the song, um, the song was um, uh, an expression that I felt had to had to come forth and, and, and be put out there. Well, the title of the new the, the, the new cut is the, is New Urban World Blues, and what I'm trying to communicate with with all of the songs is that the the themes that run along. Um, blues for Freddie Gray are 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 are, are global are, are, are global themes, and, and and we're not the only ones going through this. This is happening all over the world, and so I wanted 
let me, that's the title of the new um, album, New Urban World Blues. I wanted to communicate um, a sense of urgency about that state of existence. We're the 26th largest city. We have the 8th largest department. AV? Man. Well, that's been one of the, that's been one of the real, that's been one of the real pleasures and one of the real joys. You know, I, t I told AV after the first, after the first uh, mastering session and, and we started really talking about, you know, he started really sharing with me his concept about music and what, what he felt like music should do and, and what it, and, and, and he got me thinking, and he has me thinking about music totally different. Um, he has me thinking about my music totally different. I, I joke with him, but I'm not really joking with him when I said, look, you know, Avi, you're gonna make me rewrite all my charts, man. <laughs> Got this big old horn section, but the way you're thinking about it is so much better than the way I was initially thinking about it that I got to go back and rewrite the charts. So it's been a real pleasure, man, and it's continuing to be like a, a revelatory type of thing working with AV. Man, he's got he got something really, really special with what with what he bring to the table. Just his his ear and his mind, his heart, and his imagination. It's, it's all there. Well, I mean. Um, I was relaying to, to a friend that, you know, I, I, I spent the, the first part of my career really con uh, com uh, 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 concentrating on being a, a, a composing band leader. Never, I never had in mind to be a, a songwriter. I still don't, really. But um, just what's been coming up. Um, has had words lately. And so I anticipate um, uh, recording um, a wider variety of, um, of intersections in, in music that would involve vocals. That would involve um, vocals of various kinds, not just sung vocals, but spoken vocals in, in some things that I haven't even maybe imagined yet, I've thought about it. So I'm looking forward to it being like a real open, creative type experience. I don't know. Um, I don't know, man. I just know as a citizen, I'm entitled to have my sex. You know, let the chips fall where they fall.